This game of Commander is brought to you by Prophet of Crufix. Prophet of Crufix. Now play magic on other people's turns too. Welcome to a three player game of Commander featuring Rob playing his Rafik of the Mini deck, myself playing my Kiki Jiki Mirror Breaker deck, and Kyle playing his Savara Queen of the Golgari deck. Rob starts the game with a hand of Chromatic Lantern, Garrick Wildspeaker, Oracle Moldaya, Tropical Island, Reflecting Pool, and Maze of Ith. I go next and keep an opening hand of Helm of Possession, Clone Shell, Valakut the Molten Pinnacle, and four Snow Mountains. Kyle goes last and keeps an opening hand of Cultivate, Demonic Tutor, Explosive Vegetation, Entomb, Maelstrom Pulse, Beseju, Who Shelters All, and Forest. Rob starts by playing Tropical Island. I play Valakite. Kyle plays Lenore Wastes. Rob plays Reflecting Pool and casts Burgeoning. I play Mountain. Rob puts Maze of Ith onto the battlefield from hand with Burgeoning's effect. At the end of my turn, Kyle pays one life and entombs, putting Life from the Loam into his graveyard. Kyle dredges during his draw step, putting three cards into his graveyard and returning a Life from the Loam to his hand. Kyle then plays a forest and casts a life from the loam, returning the forest to his hand. Rob plays Celestial Colonnade. I play Mountain. Kyle draws, plays forest, and casts Cultivate, putting a swamp onto the battlefield and a swamp into his hand. Rob plays Treetop Village and casts Chromatic Lantern. I play Mountain and cast Helm of Possession. Kyle plays Swamp and casts Explosive Vegetation, putting four Swamp onto the battlefield. Rob casts a Garrick Wildspeaker and uses it to untap two target lands he controls. Rob then casts Oracle Moldaya, revealing Gilded Drake off the top of his library. I play Mountain and cast Mindclaw Shaman, targeting Rob, who reveals Bribery. I cast Bribery targeting Rob. I search Rob's deck and find Prophet of Crufix, putting it onto the battlefield. During Kyle's untap step, I untap and cast Kiki Jiki during Kyle's upkeep. I keyed Mindclaw Shaman, copying it. I target Kyle with the Mindclaw Shaman's ETV effect. Kyle reveals Maelstrom Pulse and Demonic Tutor, which I take. I search my library for a card and put it into my hand. Kyle plays Woodland Cemetery. Kyle casts Eternal Witness, bringing back Demonic Tutor. Kyle casts Demonic Tutor, Finding and casting Mesmeric Orb. The Mindclaw Shaman token dies at Kyle's instead. Rob and I both untap and mill cards. Rob plays a Vivid Meadow off the top of his library and Soul Crested Step from hand. Rob casts Sword of War and Peace and equips it to the Oracle Moldiah. Rob attacks me with Oracle. In response, I cast Clone Shell and exile a face down card. I Keege Clone Shell and exile another face down card with a copy. I block the Oracle with both the artifact creatures. Rob chooses to only kill the copy. When the Clone Shell dies, I put Bogar and Hellkite onto the battlefield, dealing 1 damage to Kyle's Eternal Witness and 4 damage to Rob's Garrick Wildspeaker, killing it. I untap and mill 6 cards. I play my 5th Snow Mountain and cast Soul Ring. I play Caged Sun and name Red. I Keege Mindclaw Shaman and target Kyle, playing his Maelstrom Pulse, blowing up the Mesmeric Orb before I untap next turn. I then attack Kyle with everything, dealing him 16 damage. Kyle passes the turn, but before Rob's turn, I flash in Hoarding Dragon and search my library for Mirror Retriever and put it underneath the Hoarding Dragon. I then Keege Hoarding Dragon and exile Thornbite Staff under that one. During Rob's draw step, I Keege Mindclaw Shaman, targeting Rob. I cast his Temp with Discovery and put Mountain onto the battlefield, dealing 3 damage to Kyle with Valapet. Rob plays Rafik and equips it with Sword of Red and White. I sacrifice my Hoarding Dragon token at Rob's instep, putting Thornbite Staff into my hand and gaining control of Rafik with Helm of Possession, which prompts Rob to concede, which then prompts Kyle to concede, winning me the game.
So whatever you're getting costs two mana? Yes. Good job. <laughs> There's Maricor. That is a good card. You can mill a bunch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can. 